actually worked on the lower level yeah, when you're in a different practice yeah when i was level. a different practice okay i didn't design it but i was a project architect on it right it was my first actually job running on, on site really so, yeah yeah so it was just it was just this lower level this was here but then we excavated behind that right and propped the whole house up wow and then put in bedrooms and stuff behind there that was initially and this so that, this that, was, that was not there. here no no that, was, that there. was there that was there but okay. not in this Layout, yeah, okay. Since doing this, we actually came back down and just not touched anything inside down here. Yeah. But we repainted the walls, put brand new doors and windows in, put new lights on, Beautiful. redid the balcony, just Gosh, so that it all tied high in. High contrast. Yeah, yeah. Wow. So just I'm... to tie it all in, because it was a bit like, oh, what are we going to do now down yeah. here? Yeah. Because it was, it was like a pale brown colour originally. Oh, was it? So yeah. that's sort of, yeah. And then we so ended up full circle. This was yeah. your first job. First, and now you've come back to kind of, you know, finish yeah. it off with your own practice. Oh, I love it. And the gardens have been done. Yeah, just that's been, been brand new brand new as well. Gardens Beautiful. redone. This path is all new. So this that is tied lovely, in with, actually. It's all recycled brick. I was yeah. going to say, where did the, where'd you pick up the brick from? Oh, um, it's got lots of paint. I can't splatter all <laughs> through it. Honest. Oh, that's wonderful. We, yeah, did that. Re so this is all, it's all existing, but we redid all this. So wow. that all tied in. This is new too, this terracotta herringbone. So this is, this is existing basically from this, well, it was from here. Wow. Back was existing, yeah. not in this redone format, but yeah. it was existing. And then there was a little set of stairs that came up here. Similar, we didn't go in the kitchen, but it was a lot smaller wow. than this. So the idea was how do we, how do you connect the old yeah. with the new? Yeah. You actually separate it and you define the old and the new. I love that. The light so the, one. Yeah, the light one. The light and one. And their last name's Welds. Oh, That's is right. it? Welds. I like love Wells, that. Wells. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. So that was the, that was how do we, instead of just smashing something together like that, why don't we separate it, let it breathe, old, transition, new. funny because I, I proposed this and the builder who I've done a lot of work with and I'm still doing a lot of work with he said to me are you sure about green are you sure I yeah, said no I trust me I was gonna me, say it me. is green right yeah, I was is, gonna say it's like a really really pale really almost eucalypt or yeah, something that's it it's a eucalypt green yeah yeah it's wow. very very soft oh, and when you see it just as a sample like that without anything around it you think he even made me double guess yeah, sort of like, yeah, yeah. yeah it's right mate just <laughs> just trust me and then we did it and then what does he do he wants to now do it at his house. Oh, he's just he done it at his house. Really? Yeah, has he? we've done his house. But he, it's, so, do um, it's just such a warmer take on that kind of, you know. Yeah, rather than just doing white. Yeah, no, exactly. everyone does white. It's pretty boring. Oh, wow. How do you just make this soft and blend in really nicely with the timber? Yeah. Well, it's soft it looks really warm. good with the concrete as it well. It looks, yeah. to be honest, that's like, and it picks up on so many other tones in the concrete mm. that you might not normally get. Yeah, it's. Well, everyone that walks through here, I, I, I didn't realise that um, when we were shooting last week, I thought I brought my wife here. Yeah. I, and I think she came through the build, but I thought I showed her at the end, but I hadn't. And she walked in and went, oh, wow, this is amazing. This is just so calm. Yeah. And the photographer used the same word. It is that it's, it's just got a really calming feeling about it. And really look, nice it doesn't hurt soft. that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you've got a great outlook. That's yeah. phenomenal. Yeah. Uh, and I love the, I mean, you've got, it's quite light up here. Yeah, it is, you've yeah. You've got these little light day as well. sort of th throughout. So it's kind of a different feeling almost to the exterior. There's a little bit, but that references that matte black when you go outside yeah. and see references back to what we've done out here. I love cutting. this herringbone detail. Yeah, it's terracotta herringbone. That's it's amazing. Something different, but the, the colour tone is similar to the floor. So it still marries in. It's not yeah. just a completely different tone. It's, it's marrying in and all the furniture client did very well 
They've furnished all this and I've had to move anything for any shoots or anything, which How is, is that? amazing. It's all Jardin furniture, Gosh, that's um, Coscala rugs. Oh, yeah. I like your storage under your stairs. Yeah, that's what double was, So what was the, what did they basically say to you when they started? Like, um, they said we wanted to, as I said, there was this, there was existing living, dining, kitchen here. Yeah. It was tiny, small, no, it was really, it felt really tight as well. Yeah, it wasn't okay. really, wasn't connected well, it was connected through this weird, narrow stair, there was a bathroom in there. And they said, well, we now want to do, this is our main living space because of this, obviously. Yeah. So we want to do, redo this. Um, and we'd like to, we'd like to get another bedroom in. Yeah. And their initial thought, and this happens often with clients, they think they sort of guide you, oh, we'll, we'll do this here and then we'll put the bedroom there. Mm -hmm. And I said, well, not really, because you're losing, you're losing this width. All of this. You know, how grand is this that, yeah. that, that and that? Yeah. Could you imagine having a bedroom there? Yeah. Just, if you, and if you like the old, what they had originally was just very tight. So I said, no, let's just open this up. You just said, no, bigger. Well, <laughs> yeah, well, it's proportionally bigger. Not just bigger for no reason, but let, let it work, let it breathe. And then let's go upstairs and put a master suite up there. Yeah. They're an older couple, so they don't need to be on the same level as kids. Their kids yeah. have grown up and moved out. Yeah. They've got grandkids. So let's put a proper master suite upstairs so you guys can have that. You've got brand new living, dining, kitchen space where everyone can gather. You've got another TV area down there. And then you've got, yeah. you've got your downstairs and all your other bedrooms. But, and then with that though, now you've just got this huge frame. Yes. Of yeah. this view. Yeah. seeing through there is Indian Head. Okay. So Avalon's, Avalon Beach is just around that headland. Right. And then this is Bangalore Headland and that's Bangalore Head wow. at the top there. So it keeps sloping up. Yeah. Interesting site. Yeah. Very oh excited to suddenly. Yeah, um, it would be. Big suddenly squalls come through here, so. So what's your exterior in order it's to- It's aluminium. Yep. Which we get a 50 year guarantee on. Right. Rather than using color bond or a steel because steel just degrades with all right. the salt. So aluminium um, exterior and brick. Don't have to do anything with brick. Yeah. So it's just maintenance free. You're used, because you, you live around here as well. So you're yeah. used to kind of this yeah. kind of extreme yeah. <laughs> yeah. climate and sort of weather conditions yeah. that you deal with. And part of what my design aesthetic is, is trying to do low maintenance builds. Yeah. Then they probably cost a little bit up front, but yeah. it just saves so much time through their life. Yeah, exactly. No one's got time these days to be maintaining houses. No. So where I can, I try and really push hardy materials that will withstand this climate or this weather, these weather Absolutely. conditions that come through here. Well, that's the thing. And there's only so much maintenance you can do though, oh, compared to some of the weather you're probably gonna get. Maintenance. Yeah. If you can do something that, I mean, this for me looks beautiful and you don't have to do anything to it. Yeah. Oh, and he's tucked behind there. Oh, that's, I like that. That would be Big lovely as well with some of the, um, if you have the door open, it'll start to kind yeah, of feel on the nice shoot with a bit of breeze. Yeah. Oh, I love it. Oh, that changes it completely. Yeah, it just changes, <laughs> changes the mood as well inside. Yeah. Which is really nice. That's beautiful. Can you get that flow? See, how nice yep. is that? Oh, that's very dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Tons of storage. Oh, it feels nice. You can never have enough. Yeah. Did you know that? Did you like design this knowing that no, I had no, this, no. or did they put this in the space afterwards? I, I thought originally this was still going to be the TV up here. Yeah. But they said, no, 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 no. We is don't there a TV? TV? Yeah, it's down in the down original. Oh, yeah. so the TV area is down there. Yeah. I like that. This yeah. is for that. So this is just, just that. sitting <laughs> or that. That's yeah. your plasma. That's it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's that side, and yeah. then the other side has the same. Oh, does it? Yeah. Oh, oh gosh, that um, pattern is beautiful. Oh, I like this. Yeah, so that's all under the stair as well. Oh. So try and maximise as much space as you can. What, is, what finish is this? That is that huge bronze. It's a bronze that's from uh, Broadway. Do you know Broadway? Yes, yeah. I do. Custom. Oh, not custom, wow. but one of their metallic finishes, yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, oh, and it doesn't that. tarnish. A lot of their stuff tarnishes, but this doesn't. Amazing. This is a really good size. So, mm. and then we redid. Look, like, this was the this was original. Yeah. But we just redid it. There was a hump in the floor here that the builder had to try and get out. Uh, we put a new concrete half in. Uh, 
new timber uh, mantelpiece <coughs> to mirror the rest of the timber. Yeah, yeah. And then just repainted it, new doors, new windows, lines, ceilings, lights. Beautiful. Oh, it's a lovely little pocket, isn't it? Yeah. Gosh, that's quite dramatic. <laughs> wow. <gasps> this is special. Yeah. Oh, I, I just love nice. this. I love how open it is that you've just got this divide and open wet area. This feels good. Oh my goodness. I made sure to frame Indian head through there. Oh, you do too. This is your, and obviously, oh, okay, so you've got these external, so but these for the privacy, yeah. Yeah, and these are off wall as well. Gosh, that view. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So it gives them full privacy when they need Wow. It. What did they say when it came to doing their master suite? What did they, did they have any kind of um, wants or? Not really, I mean, they wanted, yeah, the typical, King size bed, decent ensuite, and they've got separate walking robes in those doors there. Oh wow, okay. So program it on a program basis, that's what they wanted, but it was more about how do we deal with this? Yeah. How do we deal with you want the view? Yeah. But how do you get privacy? Yeah, so exactly. I'd seen this done before um, by another architect. And I thought, I looked into it and I thought, I think this is a good way. And I made sure to show them in my office just with Venetians. I said, you're not going to get 100%. Yeah. Well, it's not just going to be an open view. Yeah. Are you, are you okay with a filtered view? Because you can open these. That's, the, that's their full view. There's something kind of graphic about it but though that's so good. Yeah. Because you've got this kind of strong shape anyway. And you've got that beautiful branch of the Norfolk Island just framing it as yeah. well. Yeah. It is huge. Yeah. I'm assuming, so that was obviously all like, that is massive. Yeah, you can't get rid of those. You'll see them dotted all around Northern beaches. Are they all protected? Yeah, they're all yeah. protected, yeah. But you, you can trim. Obviously, when you, yeah. you know, you're building, you need to be able to trim. But they wanted to get rid of that um, branch there. So, oh no, I want to get rid of it open the view, but it's always oh, better, I think, to nice, frame. Isn't it? To, yeah, yeah. Cause it, you understand then the context of where you are because of that tree as yeah. well. Yeah. We do anyway for the Northern beaches because these trees are dotted all around here. Right. You, you get, you get so the are these sense. very signature for Northern yeah. Beaches? Yeah. They're Norfolk Island Pine. Yeah, they're okay. not endemic, obviously, because they're from Norfolk Island, but there were a plethora of them planted here. Yeah. And they're now um, protected. Oh my goodness, look at the size of the shower. <laughs> oh my God, and that's inset. Yeah, that was a yeah, recess, yeah. I love it, I love it. And you know, and I love that you've got the, the toilets not open. You need to have privacy. I yeah, don't care right. if it's a master, you know. Lovely, that frosted detail. Yeah. Let's have a look at these ropes. Am I allowed in? Yeah, they're probably just messy. Oh, though. they're such a good size. Oh my God, so these are double. Yeah, so that's hers, that's his. Oh wow, that's beautiful. Oh, that's a shot, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, and they're not another they're not another colour, it's all it's either black, brick. Yeah. So I love that brick. To be honest, the brick softens it because it's such high contrast, especially mm. when you're out the front, and the brick just kind of warms it up and it starts to then feel part of its environment as well, because you've got such older sort of, you know, yeah. with the weatherboards and that kind of older feeling. So that brick really helps it. Box gutter detail that we we came up with custom box gutter to wrap all in that aluminium as well. The connection you can see. So basically that was a gable there. Now it's now a half gable, yeah. that roof. Yeah. So that's where we chopped and we had to detail all that in so that it looked like it was always there. Right. Okay. So there's a lot of detailing just in that section to make it not look like, oh, obviously that's an add on to that. Yeah, it doesn't okay. look like that. Yeah. It looks like, oh yeah, that's, that's how it that's is. How that's it was it. meant to yeah. be. Yeah. Oh, oh.